Hello, this is Thrawd057, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you a very easy method to defeating the hard mode boss, Plantera. So, um, a few things you need to know about Plantera. Uh, they obvious, or they get summoned by these little animated moving orbs that you find in the underground jungle after you defeat the Wall of Flesh and go into hard mode. So, th these are what you need to summon him, and there are a lot of them, don't worry, they're not, like, super rare. Uh, yeah, you'll find them around the place, and if you just hit them with your pickaxe and they break then you summon plantera so um uh things you'll need to defeat him obviously you'll need health potions because the underground jungle is a very dangerous place whoa i got a hornet banner anyway um you ha should have an iron skin potion and a thorns potion because this boss is actually pretty challenging um a uh, clockwork assault rifle uh probably an excalibur gungnir i mean like all these things if you defeat the um the story over and over, you get like all these hollowed bars, which you can make these items out of. Go check out that um, tutorial. It will be in the link below. It will be like how to get hollowed bars easier. And then you can also make hollowed um, uh, armor. So this is like the bare minimum what you should have to defeat this boss. And yeah, so I'm gonna. And then also like for bullets, you can, should have at, either crystal bullets or silver bullets. I prefer silver bullets. Um, but yeah, so, I'm going to, oh yeah, also, um, you should also find an orb that's in an open area, where am I, uh, right here, yeah, so like, an open area right here, not like, up here somewhere where there's like, really little space to move around, you ha you need space to move around, or else you'd, uh, get trapped and he'd corner you and stuff, and you don't want that, so you don't need to build like an arena or anything, just build, just get like a big area like this, and then you'll be good. So, I haven't faced this boss in a while, so I'm going to be a little bit rusty. Okay, Plantera has awoken. Where is he? There he is. Um, get your clockwork assault rifle. It doesn't have to be a clockwork assault rifle. It can be like any kind of um, really fast assault rifle. Um, but I prefer it because it's really f quick, and it does a lot of damage. And yeah, so you just want to fly around and keep... Um, hitting him with your, uh, oh wait, I haven't drank my potions yet. <laughs> I'm derm. Um, okay. So, first I'm gonna drink my potions. I should have done that before, but I'm just now doing it. It's kind of bad. Alright, so, there's one. Now for the iron skin. And, uh, yes. Here we go. Flamethrower is optional, it's a good weapon to use against him, but really what you'll need is a uh, rifle with lots of bullets. And this is only his first stage, and he's pretty slow, and he just moves around trying to follow you. And yeah, you can make some random little platforms everywhere, just so you don't have to keep flying, and you fall down or accidentally or something. Yeah, just like, keep moving around and make sure he doesn't get too close to you, then um, yeah, you'll be good. So, yeah, oh, there's my iPod. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that, by the way. I should have put my, um, Let's Play up today, but I didn't have time. So I'm doing this video instead, and it should be up tomorrow. Um, yeah. So, it's obviously gonna take a little while, because I've been hitting him consistently, and he's our only, like, almost halfway health right now. And he hasn't even transformed yet. And see these little... Uh, spiky little pink balls. Uh, he launches those and like, um, oh, yep, see, this is second stage. And then they just bounce up everywhere. And also, during the second stage, it's kind of like the wall of flesh where there's these, um, things coming after you. I'm gonna drink a health potion because I'm getting low on health. And he's almost dead. Just for the fun of it, I'm gonna use my flamethrower, even though you don't need to have one. I just like to use it. It's fun. Um, yeah, this thing does a lot of damage, too. There we go. We got a pygmy staff. I'm going to take a screenshot, because I love taking screenshots, if you don't know already. <laughs> um, here, and get this heart. Um, so, yeah, I got, ooh, I got the wasp gun. I haven't got that before. Pygmy staff, and you always get a temple key. Temple keys can be used for, um, getting into the lizard temple. Um, or if you don't have the temple key and you're impatient, you can just um, like, blow up the door with dynamite, it, that works too, and, um, yeah, so you can use this also for 
making uh, the key for when you get key molds, which are very rare. One 2,500 drop from any monster in that area. And um, so, yeah, that's basically how you um, defeat Plantera. And just remember to get um, a sh an orb that's, like, around a big area. And there's, there's Plantera's ball there. Um, yeah, so, like, down here would be fine, because once he's awoken, you can just fly up here real quick. And then, uh, fight. But really, you need to get a, um, an orb that's near or already in a big area like this. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. In my next video, I'm going to be defeating Gollum, um, which is the boss inside the Lizard Temple. And, yeah, so subscribe for more Terraria videos, and I'll see you in the next one.